Is it true that you got the juiciest fat in DC? I would prefer to say DC, Maryland, and Virginia. Right. Like the tri state fuck area. So, East yeah. Coast, then fuck it. Tri state area, yeah. East Coast? Mm mm. Ain't nobody fucking with you on that. There's some thick in the East Coast. No, when I went to the is. baddies East, I seen a lot of East Coast hoes. Them hoes ugly, but them hoes is thick. Hey, no, nah, this wasn't even a part of the question, but like, what's up with the baddies East shit? How you feel about that type shit? Because it was a lot of raggedy there, fool. Longest time, like all day, but I think like they already had cast pick ahead of time, mm -hmm. which I had heard somebody had told me that, but it's just like I'm thinking like, nah, that that's terrible. Like, why would they be on there? You know, but they did already pick a lot who was already already known, been, famous already famous or whatever. Shit. I wasn't sure I'm all that famous or all that known, but I, I think mean, I'm known enough to be able to have received the opportunity. I'm not salty about it because I know yeah, TV is TV, so. I'm not mad at that, but I just think that that was an opportunity for them to give somebody opportunity, and they, they had to audition at D.C., and now D.C. ho in it, so it's like, you know. Nah, they bull I letting you in there. Like, you really, like, one of them ones coming out this jump. Bro. I think I got potential. That's why I'm about yeah. to move and take it, you know, mm -hmm. take it somewhere else. You just roll out. Never know. What made you name yourself 7TV? Like, what's the backstory about that? I ain't gonna hold you. It just sounds cool. I came up with it, and I liked it. I just ran with it. It's like you could really give yourself a nickname. And then motherfuckers start calling you that when they meet you. It's like, what's your name? And if I tell you that's my name, what else you gonna call me, you know? Dude, I thought you named yourself 7TV because it's like, that motherfucker hit on the 7 time. Nah, more like 7, 7 seconds, girl. 7 what? 7 seconds, girl. If I was on my, if I was my name would be 7 seconds. Why, why 7 seconds? In and out. Is that junk fake or real type shit? What's a BBL, y'all? How you know I was talking about that? What else you was talking about? No, I was definitely talking about that. This a BBL? There's a BBL, y'all. So what made you get a BBL? Hold up. What you want with me? What? He trying to get some of this concoction right here, man. This ghetto. He got his own. I only really want. But this is a BBL. It's like almost three years old. So, yeah. So you've been keeping up with Mm-hmm. I don't exercise or nothing like that. But I do. Well, I don't eat healthy and I don't watch what I eat either. So I don't know. I just be vibing. With a BBL. Mm-hmm. I probably need to hit the gym. That's why I be getting fat and shit, like, mm -hmm. over time. But as long as my butt be, I don't care. That's all that matter. Has a BBL changed your life? A BBL where I changed my life. Like, maybe a new girl. Just, just live for it. I live for it. Then live for it. It's like um like a watch. Like, you know how somebody get a watch and you just, uh, uh, uh. Somebody get a chain. AP, you get mm -hmm. you a bus now. You, uh, uh, uh. The body, that's an investment. Like, it just really, like, just changes. Mm-hmm. I don't know exactly where you from, but you from the DMV, right? Like, where you from type shit? I grew up in Capitol Heights, Maryland. Then my mom was in the military. I started moving around. I lived with my sister in the Southeast. Mm -hmm. Then my dad in Southeast. So I kind of moved around. But I'm not like a super Maryland girl, but I'm not really like a city girl either. Bro, I thought you was like a Southeast jump. I don't know. People think that. I think just because I'm just, you know, good around. All right, we got finished the lyric. Okay, go ahead. So he just ate my... He just ate my... You want to switch? Hey, now I'm eating. So you eat? <laughs> no, I would never. I seen you at the uh, Sukiyana joint. You was on top and shit. You yeah, was taking that bro. shit with your heart. You got the video? I mean, Plug I, it in I there. can find a video. Plug it in there for them. You say so you eat type shit? You know. You ever thought about it? Men be hurrying. It definitely and do. nothing make me want to put my face down there. What's some shit that has had to qualify for seven TV? For the fuck with me and nigga, I have. At least a like a hustle about them, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like I was with who had some hustle and lost it. So, so you like, left his ass too. I ain't just leave him though. I wrote I gave him some time to get it together. A long time. You gave his ass a 30 day notice? I should have gave him a 30 day notice, but instead I gave him a baby. Damn. Sit down. But yeah. You gotta have some hustle about you. You gotta have your own car, your own career. That's just so that you're responsible, can keep up with something. Mm -hmm. That's about it though. I'm not saying I have a cool little AP, even though I would be preferred. You don't got no chain on that stuff. It would be preferred, though. Preferred? Yeah, preferred. The that would be my nigga, preference. Time is time. What, what, what does time got to do with a nigga? You the said what a AP, nigga got to have. AP. You, you got, said what a nigga got to have. I ain't saying he got to have an AP. It would just be preferred. Damn. For the fuck with me, it would just be preferred. A nigga don't got to have that, because I don't got no AP. I still got me a cute little rolly, you know? I'm surprised you ain't wear the day. I wear the silver off the mm. <laughs> No, I would too. No funny. Mm -hmm. All right. Why well, I'm getting nervous? Go ahead. You said what? Why well, I'm getting nervous? Nervous for what? Well, what you about to say? No, I'm not. It ain't no wild shit. You can only say one. Shot Glizzy, Fat Trail, Rolling Ray. I'm gonna have to say Fat Trail. 
You know he big as shit. He big as shit. I don't know how I'm gonna save him. I'm gonna save him though. I like Shark Lindsay and I like Rolling Ray, but I just gotta save that real. Alright, uh, now nah, what's your relationship with DC artists like? <laughs> Cause he be posting, now nah, he do be posting the shit out you every chance. Like, I don't know. You can fuck, he gonna post that motherfucker. Right? <laughs> I think he just like bad. <laughs> he like bad <laughs> clearly. So yeah, but I don't know. I just met you. I just met him just you know through the grapevine. And he just yeah, you ever, have you ever seen that nigga before? I could see him walking down the street, wouldn't he know? Damn. Real life. So it's like I could be somewhere and he be right there. Oh yeah. Don't never know. See DCR, I think he's slick. I know the real him, bro. But. <laughs> It's cool. He try to figure it. Yeah, me don't though. blow his cover. I ain't gonna. I ain't gonna blow his cover. I'm wanting to keep doing this thing. <laughs> What's your turn ons and turn offs type shit? Mm. Turn ons will be my gentleman. Um, I like when drive. When you looking at your man drive, it's just like mm, you look turn so you fine. On? Yeah, make a nigga tell a nigga pull over. So pull over and do what? You know. Eat you that, know the vibes. Eat that Jonah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. I don't like moody niggas. That's turn off. I don't like sassy niggas turn off i don't like nigga talking back to me tell me why you do this why you do that i don't like none of that shit like that i just don't like a nigga that try to control me i only had one boyfriend but he wasn't all like he wasn't controlling for real but even mm. ah! damn hey, we ain't editing that out <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck was that did you fucking see that what was it i don't know but that <laughs> flying fast <laughs> what i was talking all right maybe i was saying some shit no, i wasn't no, that was calm <laughs> Nope. Was talking, she was talking shit. I was talking shit. She definitely was talking shit. It's okay, baby. It was a bug trying to get me. She was talking crazy. Talking crazy. That shit no, went, I'm okay. That shit I got it now. You. Thank you, though, boo. I don't like Twitter niggas. Damn. I don't like niggas that bash what women What the fuck is Twitter? Oh, bash women? Yeah. That's... They said they said I'd be bashing women. I don't think you bash women. I think you a supporter of women, but I ain't going to... Like, you don't hate hoes, but some niggas clearly hate hoes. Yeah, I like, be saying I don't think you shit. hate hoes. I think you love the hoes, but... Mm. You not like probably like not like a one woman kind of nigga, so that's probably why they be like, oh he blah blah like whatever yeah. you know. Yeah. Was any rappers in the industry try to bag you? Y'all, every sometimes I be having an industry, but sometimes like oh fuck on me now what the it was just a fly but still it, oh I right, fuck it all right but um it be some industry that I be bagging I can't really name drop y'all might fucking know. I be just like to just be in my business. What are you from? East Coast or West Coast? Just I'm gonna say South. Yeah, All the country so you... niggas with the accents, they like me. Already. Because South can range from, you know. All so, right. but I ain't gonna. I be shooting my shot. You do? I sure You be do. shooting your shot every time. You be in them DMs. I do. What is Cyber saying in the DMs? I d just depend. Like if he, a lot of the times the industry niggas don't always post a lot on their stories, so like you gotta mm -hmm. catch it. Yeah. I'm gonna get y'all game. Post my story. I don't give a fuck who it is. I ain't gonna name drop, but I don't give a fuck who it is. You could DM a kiss emoji, not responding to the story. That's real cute. Don't follow because that be on dicks. He gonna DM you back. If you that girl, you one of the ones. If you stand out, he gonna DM you back. Oh yeah. I ain't shot my shot. I'd be surprised. But the industry niggas be busy, so yeah. It might take a nigga 15 minutes, or it might take a nigga four months to respond. Damn. But they be responding. What kind of junk you is? You like a junk that blow up the DMs? Or you like a one DM? No, nah, look, I, I'm, I'm a one DM wonder. If you miss your opportunity, then you just do. What? Some I'm going to throw a kiss. Is you just go catch it. Or you just, you know, you ain't seeing check because you busy. But I damn near, I damn near make every shot. I mean, shit, with that BBL, shit, hey. Changed your fucking life, didn't it? Sure did. Uh, you want to hear a story? Go ahead. We got time. Mm. This is the story. I got a BBL, though. Don't don't air this. No, we definitely we definitely not gonna air. Yeah, don't air that part. But I was with my baby mom for a long ass time, and one time he was cheating on me. I don't think I already told him about it. It was with a fat boy. <laughs> little Spanish. Mm, nah, them Hispanic bitches be like that. But it's like chill out, like, like this nigga move out of town for a couple months. Mm -hmm. Why this nigga come home and just the man, the universe told me to check his phone? I look at the nigga phone. This phone. Why? The fuck, this was having like a like a damn second girlfriend damn near up with a Spanish bitch. So basically, you was the side. I was the side bitch, and I was the main bitch the whole time. I'm the side bitch though, cause I'm not dead. Usually, I go through my man's phone and be crying and shit. This time when I went through his phone, I had just seen a post like real out like either the same day or some shit like around that time when it happened. I had seen a post that was like, next time you going through a nigga phone, go straight to the cash shop. Don't even check the messages. Damn, the cash shop. 
What I do? Go straight to the cash shop. He was cash shopping? No, I start cash shopping myself. Damn. I send myself as many thousands that will come through and Damn, got my body you done. Fucking, you got you got your body done with his bread? That nigga's sweet. I'm just that don't make all that sweet. Shit. That was um what's that called when you owe somebody some money for something you did? Reper not repercussions. Not requisitions. Reparations. So he basically paid for that shit. And now you just out here just throwing that ass around and for hey, it's crazy. But um but I know this question. But any any rewriter try to bag seven TV, man. And did you and did you go? <laughs> Sometimes they do. But I just think that it's a bad move for business because but you know they do. No, it's bad. Some, it's, it's cool when it's cool when Mum bag yo and all these other uh rapper niggas. But when a motherfucker from the local look, DM, so, just the local looks terrible. I'm not even saying I wouldn't I wouldn't fuck with no local nigga. I like my rappers out of state. You like that so accent? Do, that too. I could do a local rapper nigga, mm. but like from Florida or a local rapper nigga, but from somewhere else. I wouldn't prefer a local rapper nigga from where I'm at because he all be going to all do research and all that. Mm. Don't do no research on me. Just, okay. just know what I say. What I say is what it is. That sound like a girl that ain't shit. Do you ask me? Call it what you want. But have you ever been flown out and was it a robber? Yes, I got flowed out before. I got flowed out twice. Was it What kind of flight was it? Spirit? No. Delta? The first time I got flewed out. First class Delta, but that's because it was a long ass flight. The second time I got flewed out, instead of him like paying for the flight, mm -hmm. he sent me the money for the flight. So I booked it. So I'm a Southwest girl. You get them cheeks up. I ain't get them cheeks you up, man. You had to. I'm ain't not flying nobody out. I, I can't get... say for real because I don't want to get, you know. I mean, you ain't saying who it is, but fuck all that. He found you first class. He went first class. Just uh, because a nigga fly you out, don't mean you got to give up no kids. What? Did you come here for a meet? We I'm here for a meet and greet. A meet and greet? It depends. This is meet and cheeks. So, I, you know, I, I did my little research type shit, and I seen you backstage and shit, but, you know. Was it mum bag yo and some? It was it was just hella nigga with chains. I thought it was a slavery thing. <laughs> it was so many chains. I thought it was slavery. But you was around a bunch of niggas with money on. Do you think it's easier for a female to get in the industry? Cause niggas are die to get in them positions, bro. So you think it's easy for a female to get in the industry than a? I think it is easier for females because all you have to do is have a pretty face. And look like you put some money into yourself, rather it be your body done, your done, you got a chain, you got a watch. Even if you ain't put the own money into yourself, if you got a pretty face and you look like something, then you already there. Nigga don't even know your personality and you in these rooms. Mm -hmm. Most of the time, though, when I'm in rooms like that, I don't really end up saying much. I'm kind of just, I mean, I'll speak to people, mm -hmm. but it's like you a female, excuse me, you a female, so you in the room, so you don't want to be like on for real, you know? Mm -hmm. It could easily look like you. Yeah. So I don't really always say something, but on some fangirl yeah, shit. Yeah, I don't want to be no fangirl shit. Cause if Wow 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 flew me out and I see Woo Woo Woo, then I just gotta just be pee. I can't really be like, oh, I feel. you know, or whatever I want. So I can't even shoot my shot. See, normally, you know, I thought you would have had that rolling on. I swear, I thought it's you. It's in the hole, man. Why, why didn't you? I got my damn baby. I had to get you. I got you. See, I got talkies and yeah, uh, I feel. Sip, fruit cause cause I thought you was gonna out. bring Rolly out. So, you know, I didn't want to be left out. So Ooh. I had to bring. Oh, that's a red job. Yeah, I, I, I had to bring. I ain't hard to find a party riding something red. My nah, dad I, I thought we both was going to be, you know, what what, what what sexy red say? Damn, hold on, man. Fucking hold it up. Ski, yeah. Oh, that's some new shit? Huh? That's new? You fuck with it? I fuck with it. You like it? I like shit it. Shit like yours, don't it? Yeah, mine a pink. Mine, he got red face, though. Mine pink, though. And you got the gold, but I'm not really a big fan of gold, so uh -huh. I went all silver. Yeah. But now I'm playing Jane, though. But if you seen a nigga with the joint like that, he got some little bit cash. I don't know, though, but I learned, I think a little bit, but mine was a gift. So uh -huh. I know the price range, mm -hmm. but it just depends. But I, I be seeing different style. Roly's supposed to be a starter kit. It's a starter so I'm like, kit. oh, he just getting him some money. He probably tricked. Yeah. Oh, yeah? It's fake. But, um... <laughs> Just wanted to, just wanted to see where what your head was at. <laughs> Wait, let me see. I got that from New York. Oh, a nigga probably would have fooled me if I sank yeah, it on yeah, his wrist. Yeah, yeah, fooled the shit out you. Oh, well, that. it don't have that much weight. I'm going to wear the you. shit out that bitch now. <laughs> it don't it. got no weight on it and, and no it. marks and shit. Yeah, oh, got, they got that on it, though. They did. They did their shit with that one. But nah, This I got, bitch tick. Oh, this yeah. whole ticking, ain't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. Sure nah, man. I got that from New York for a skit. You know what I'm saying? But Hey, but you might rock that bitch for real. You would have got me. But you never know, though. Nigga shit be fake, though. A lot of these Not niggas even should be watches, fake. but like chains and shit. Like, nah. I'm about to get a chain. 
But I'm learning the, the difference in diamonds and stuff like this. And how much this costs for that? And how much this costs for that? And like I just heard something about something called like moissanite yeah, diamonds. Yeah, moissanite diamonds. A lot of that should be yeah. moissanite. All right, I got a question for you. Do you think that girls can wear fake chains and boys can't? Cause like bitches had a little name, little bling shit that we could get anywhere, like this. I mean, I mean, no, I'm talking about like an actual chain though. I mean, you're a female, so it, it, it's like, but with niggas, it's more like a. I mean, if you gonna go big, go home. Don't buy no fake shit. Go all out. For niggas or hoes? For niggas. If I buy me a pre chain, I want that joint big as shit. I'm not getting no little ass. I ain't gonna hold you. That shit be expensive though. It do, but it's so you like, realize fuck I gotta it. be. You know, you realize if you gonna, I get if you gonna do it, do it. Mm. That's how I love. Mm. I had a budget when I first was getting my chain started, and I'm like, yeah, this the budget. Well, well, he said, all right, this what you can get. Da da da. Mm. Oh, the chain was the size of a lighter. Damn, a big junk. A big lighter. Like you a, better get like you a, a moisten light. light. That's why they bring girls <laughs> chains the biggest shit. Man, somebody has said sexy red in the interview was saying she paid like five dollars for her big ass chain. For I would have bought if I was her. I would have bought that too. That's just cute, you know. It's cute shit, yeah. but I mean, hey, this is why nobody touched that diamond test is over with. Mm. But um.